Today let us see how to install Windows 11 on VirtualBox. Click on VirtualBox application. Click on New and create new virtual machine. Enter the name. Choose Type Microsoft Windows. Select version other Microsoft 64-bit. Click Next. Select memory size 4096 megabytes. Click Next. Create virtual hard disk. Select hard disk file type as VDI. Click Next. Select dynamically allocated hard disk. Choose file location and select size up to 25 gigabytes and create. Go to General Settings. Click Advanced. Select Shared Clipboard and drag and drop as bidirectional. All System Settings. Click Motherboard. Select Chipset as ICH9. Click on Processor. Select 4 CPU cores. Click on Acceleration. Select Interface to Hyper-V. Go back to Processor and enable Nested VD and Extended Features. Go to Display Settings. Maximize the video memory to 128 megabytes. Select VBox VGA in the Graphics Controller and enable the 3D acceleration. Go to Storage Settings. Click on Controller IDE and check if the attribute type is PIX4 and check the host I.O. cache. Click on Windows Pro VDI and check Solid State Drive Attributes. Click on Empty. Checkbox Live CD slash DVD and Attributes. Click on the blue disk on the optical drive. Select Choose a disk file and select the release ISO file from the local storage. Click Open. Go to Audio Settings. Enable Audio. Go to Network Settings. Uncheck Enable Network Adapter for Temporary. Go to USB Settings. Enable the USB controller. Click OK. Click Start on Virtual Box Manager. Start up the disk by selecting Start. Wait for the Windows setup to load. Select the language to install and click Next. Click on Install Now. Click on I don't have a product key. Choose Windows 11 Pro 64-bit. Click Next. Check the I accept Microsoft license terms. Click Next. Select Custom Install Windows Only in Advanced Setup. Click on the new drive on allocated space. Enter size 25,600 megabytes and apply. Click OK. Select Partition 2. Click Next. Wait until the installation files are ready. Restart the system.
Select the country or region you reside. And click Yes. Select Keyboard Layout. And click Yes. Skip the secondary keyboard layout. Connect to a network. Click on I don't have a internet. Continue with a limited setup. Enter your name. Click Next. Choose a password. Click Next. Confirm password. Click Next. Select three security questions. Click Next. Choose privacy settings which is required for you. Click Accept. Welcome to the new Windows 11 user interface. Thank you.